Shea Bear 1000 here. Today we're going to be doing another unboxing, review, whatever, of these wireless mics I got. Uh, you can probably tell by the title, that's what we were going to be doing. So, let's go ahead and get into this, open it up. Let's see what, what it comes with and how well it sounds. Okay guys, so these came almost a week early, so that's good. I'll be able to use them this weekend when we go camping. Um, so remember, we're going to be doing a live stream while we're out there, so you don't want to miss that. Stick around for that. That should be fun. Hopefully, we can do the live stream while we're fishing. Monkey's pretty excited. It's kind of a... Like I said, this place is down the road. We've, you know, we've never been there. So, we thought we'd check it out. I mean, just because it's close, don't mean a lot of people think, well, if you don't go out of town, you're not really getting away from home. But that's really not true. I mean, a lot of, a lot of cool places can be found around where you live. So, <clears throat> it's a knife. It's dull. I don't think it's supposed to be, I think it's more of a novelty knife, but it was one of her dad's knives. I decided to keep for using, uh, for opening boxes, packages, whatnot, so works fine for that, <laughs> somewhat. I just need to put it on the sharpening stone. I've got a hell of a nice sharpening stone in there. Well, it's old, but it, it's nice. I mean, it, it works really well. I got some poppers for Monkey. And I usually put my shotgun mic on. I'm sitting to the left of the camera. And I usually put my shotgun mic on and point it towards me. And I forgot to do that. So, what I'm going to do... There's... Well, that's that's a nice packaging. I mean, they did a good job packaging. These were sixty-five dollars. So, let me get my mic so you're not just hearing it out of one side of your speakers. Okay, guys. Hopefully, that's better. Uh, no, there's no there's no issue with your headphones if you have your headphones on. It's because, like I said, uh, this camera has a left and right mic on it, and I'm sitting to the left of the camera, so. Like I said, right now I got my little shotgun mic pointed towards me, so that way you should be able to get a uh, both sides. So, nice packaging, very nice, nice box. Uh, I never heard of this. Fee Horley, <laughs> uh, UHF wireless recording microphone system. Okay, uh, working distance 100 meters, 16 channel. <coughs> that's good because if I'm having trouble with planes going past because remember my my other mics whenever a plane went past and I was outside uh, it would create some feedback until the plane was gone so I can change channels so that don't happen uh, it's got a volume knob a monitor so um, you can plug headphones in and you can hear actually hear what you are recording you can hook it up smartphone, computer, camera, or camcorder. Okay, so uh, nice little, nice little carrying handle there. Um, like I said, I've never heard of this company, so I've never used their products. So let's go ahead and tear into this thing. I'm getting a little excited for the weekend. We are leaving Friday night. Wow, this is cool. Now my other ones, um, they they came, they had a little case for them too, but, or did they? I think the Booyah mics had a case to them. Um, it was just a tiny case, but... I mean, and they, they worked good, but I didn't buy them this time because uh, last time, what I give for them? Uh, 40 bucks or something. They lasted a few years. 
which is fine. I'm taking 40 bucks. I was going to get another set of them. They're now the cheapest ones I could find was $79. I could find them for 45 used. I was like, no, because, you know, when did they buy them and how good did they work? You know, here's your, uh -oh. okay, here's the uh, instruction, instruction manual here. Goes through all this stuff, troubleshooting. Um, this is the camera audio cable right here. So this is the one we will be using. Um, this one is for your mobile phone audio cable. So this is for your smartphone and messaging monkey. This one is for, and this is the mic. Okay, cool. Now, I don't see headphones. So it says headphones there, but it doesn't say it comes with it. Um, so, But that's fine. I've, I've got headphones. And got a little antenna here. Okay. And also, that one set that I bought, it just had clips on both on both the, the transmitter and receiver. Well, the receiver... You know, you, you you want one of these so you can clip it on your cam. You know, put it on your camera on your cold cold shoe mount, uh, or you can clip it on to something there. And here's the on off switch. Um, here's the output. Here's your uh, for your headphones right here. Okay, there's that. Like I said, here is the mic. Hopefully, it'll be a good sounding mic. Uh, it has some pretty good reviews. It's like a 4.1 or 4.5 star. I can't remember which one. So it had had a pretty good review. Uh, someone did say that they would compare it to the um, to the Buyas. Okay, so this is um, your transmitter. Okay, so there's your line in your mic on off switch and again your antenna so it doesn't get broke and I do kinda like the antennas um, now what I didn't think to check is I'm pretty sure I got batteries yes so it's gonna take oh so there's your volume control and your channel right there and I did not think to check but I do have these are double A batteries I do have double A batteries thank goodness or I'd be messaging monkey when you getting off work see again volume and channel so I'm gonna get some batteries and we're gonna put some batteries in here and we're gonna pair these up and I'll get you um, plugged in also a lot of times guys these mics if you if you spend a few extra bucks on these lavalier mics you can get a better sound and quality. It's not always just these things that, that make the sound. 90% uh, of it, as long as these are paired good and they're working well, uh, you know, with no feedback or interference, you know, it's up to your microphone after that. So, okay, which I used to use my uh, Insignia mic. It was wired, but I would, you know, I would uh, plug it into this, into my transmitter, and course I had that long ass cable it was like 20 foot of cable or whatever cord and and I would use it and it sounded phenomenal because that was an excellent mic okay so let's go ahead and get this out this is for the camera all right now I'm not sure what the difference is on these I'm not sure if there is a difference yeah yeah, there is a difference here. All right, there. See the difference in these two pieces. This one's for the phone. See, there is a difference. So don't get them confused, or it probably won't work properly. All right, again, let's go ahead. I think these sync up automatically to whatever channel they're on, but I'm going to read through it just to make sure. But I'm pretty sure. At whatever channel you put it on I, I do believe they will sync up so let me get some batteries we'll put them in 
and then we'll try them out and see how it sounds see and take a walk around the yard or something see how well it does okay guys I've already got the batteries in this one it's real easy to do and yes it says it should already be paired it does have instructions on how to uh, change the channels so that's all you got to do there and you put this back on all right now it says the first thing to do is uh, the receiver which will be for the camera which is this one here the receiver you always know the receiver if it has a headphone or an output because the output will go right into the uh, into your mic port on your camera it says mount it or whatever you're going to do with it now I'm going to show you I'm going to use monkey's camera I'll show you how to do that here in just a minute okay and then plug the audio cable into the receiver out put right there monitor output connector connect the other end of the audio cable to the camera's mic audio output connector that doesn't sound right but just plug it into your mic um, port on your camera then it says turn the power switch on and the indicator light turns green then the transmitter pretty much same way insert the lavalier microphone into the transmitters mic microphone input connector which will be right there where it says mic okay then it says uh, plug the audio cable plug into the receiver output output monitor output connector whatever um, so Wait, I just read that wrong. I just read the wrong thing to you. Okay, insert the lavalier microphone. It's going to go in there. All right. Then it says, uh, plug the audio cable plug into the receiver's line in audio input connector, which would be that one. That's That would be for your phone. Okay, so we're not going to worry about that. We're going to be using this one here. All right. Then it says uh, turn the power switch to on and the indicator light turns green. Clamp the device around your waist or in your pocket. Uh, it says um, if the radio signal of the receiver and transmitter are connected properly, the green indicator light on of the receiver will be bright. The number of channels displayed by the digital light is the same as the is that of the transmitter if it is connected the green indicator of the receiver will flash continuously receiver and transmitter are paired already and can be used directly after booting okay so what we're going to do is first okay we're going to our receiver which is going to be here we're going to uh, plug the audio cable into the receiver output monitor output connector so that's this one so what we're going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and do that right now and now I'll show you how to plug it into the camera like I said I'll use monkey's camera okay so I'm going to plug it into that just like that now this end is going to go into your camera and this end here is just you know going to go to your cold shoe or hot shoe whatever I have a hot hot slash cold shoe on here you can use either one now the hot shoe mount is powered which this is is a powered it, it is a hot shoe but you can also run um, a uh, you know just different things on it you know um, just put it in there if you want um, so I don't know I'm gonna have to see if this has got room because of this um, piece on top it looks like it might so let me get uh, monkey's camera out and I'll show you how to hook this up okay guys I'm on monkey's camera this is how I can tell when the mic is working right there in the corner see that as I talk that's how I can tell if it's working I get this one on I'm gonna go ahead and take this off I'm gonna go ahead and unplug it here now I'll show you the difference now see since this mic is oops sorry since this mic is off if you can see I'm sitting on the left hand side of the camera and I'm getting most of my uh, input on the left side so that's why I usually 
do this. Now, again, like I said in the review of the camera, I don't, I don't like that. I mean, I'm surprised I haven't snapped that off already. I don't like that at all. But anyway, we're going to take our... I always try to point this, if I can, towards... Yeah, it'll fit. I always try to point it towards the... Uh, hopefully this is not going to get in the way. Towards the um, transmitter. That way, you know, there's a um, better chance of it picking up. Okay, so we're just going to plug this end in here. See, there we go. See, just like that. So it's going, it's coming from the output and it's going into the input onto the camera. Okay, hopefully it's not going to pick up, no, it's not, it's not going to pick up the, uh, the antenna. Okay, now it says to turn it on. So let's go ahead and flip this switch on here. Just like that. It looks like it's on channel 9. Now we're going to go ahead, we're going to plug our mic in where it says mic. Boom. Okay, now I'm going to take, sorry, I'm trying to do this one handed. And, because I knew if I set up a tripod, I would just keep moving the damn tripod around. So, All right. so there's this. Now we're going to turn this on, right there. Okay, nine and nine. Okay, green light, green light. I thought this was supposed to be flashing, but I'm talking right here, and you can see that it is picking up my voice. Okay, right here. Check, check one, two. So, all right. So, now we're going to clip this. I'm just going to clip it on on my pocket right there. Then I'm going to clip this on up here to me. Check, 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 check. See, it's, it's working. It's working great already. Can you see that? Okay, so... Let's put this on here, and the next clip you're going to see is going to be with this camera here and this mic system. Okay guys, so hopefully this is not too loud, but I'm maxing out on my little gauge up here. I'm talking very low, so I'm not blowing your eardrums out if you got headphones on because I don't know how this sounds yet, and I will not know how it sounds until I put it on to the PC. And then I'll have to listen to it and get back with you guys and tell you, you know, my final thoughts on it. But right now we're going to try this out. So I'm going to take you guys outside. As you can see, I've got it on here. See, And it looks like both sides are pretty much equal. Um, what if I go like this? Pretty much equal. If I go like this, pretty much equal. Okay. Because I noticed on my other ones... If I turn my head too far or something, it would uh, make a difference in the left and right. Now, according to this gauge, it seems to be okay. So, um, like I said, I'll have to check it out first, and then I'll let you guys know what uh, what my final thoughts are. Now, I'm going to take you outside. I'm going to walk around a little bit. Let's see how it does. Okay, guys, we're going to check the distance. Um, it says... 60 meters which is what right around 180 feet ish somewhere right in there now i'm not sure how far that is but i'm pretty sure it's not 180 feet now of course when i get back there i'm not going to be able to see if this gauge is working so i'm going to walk all the way back to that red tote i don't know if you can see it there's a little statue there a little bird bath i'm going to walk back to there and i'm going to talk to you guys and like i said i won't know anything until i put it in the computer and listen to it and find out for myself and then i'll kick you guys back on so after this clip that's what i'm going to do then then we'll go to the garage and we'll talk about it okay so i'm going to just keep talking to you guys <coughs> excuse me in a normal voice 
I'm just chit chatting away. Hopefully it's still working. Uh, like I said, it was uh, I got it for sixty-five dollars, and well, let's call it—it it was like six dollars shipping. So it was like um, you know whatever seventy to do to do seventy-one dollars or something. So I'm waving at you. Now I'm going to go around the shed here. Okay, and uh, so I'm walking around the shed. Now this may, you know, that that at 60 meters is uh, like a straight shot too. By the way, it's not. So I'm walking around the shed. It might not pick it up. So I don't know if you can see me over here or not. But I'm over here, and now I'm going to go over here by the garden, and um, I've got. Man, my, my um, peppers are really kicking ass. <laughs> and, you know, it's pointing towards the end of October. And I'll show these to you here. All right. So, oh, I guess I was out of, out of shot there for a minute. Okay, let me get you off of here. And get you turned around here so I can see what you're looking at. Um, the tomatoes is, is weird. These are they're not growing, they're not producing, but they're not dead yet, and they're hanging down there. But these are all dead. Okay, so as you can see, I still got a bunch of peppers. There's one that needs to be picked there. I still got a bunch of well cayenne peppers, and then I've got up here on this thing it's getting weighted over because i thought they were done so i didn't tie it up or anything where's that there's one here right there and there's one here um let me see there's one here pretty good size one there's one here pretty good size one I've got let me see is there one up here now so I've got three here <laughs> there's one there's two and there's three that's gonna be a good one there so my pepper plants really kicked ass <coughs> excuse me so yeah guys all right so sorry about that so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to take this footage in, put, I'm going to uh, import it to the PC, and then I'm going to listen to it and see how well it does and um, see if it broke up or if I got any kind of interference or feedback or anything like that. I also need to check the, the um, which I, I can't do it with you guys, but I will check it and let you know how the... Um, Trying to close this little door. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and plug my headphones in. And I'm going to listen to them. But I'll let you know in the next clip how well they sounded. So I'll be right back with you guys in just a second. Let you know what's going on. Okay guys, I thought I'd throw this in, in here for you. I know you guys can't tell. But I can really tell that it is working. It seems to be working fine. Um, it's kind of hard to say with your voice, you know, now if I had somebody else to talk for me it would be better, but so, but I can tell it's working, it's working out both, both sides. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put, I'm going to, I've got a splitter, I'm going to plug this into it with, with the mic that goes in these and I'm going to see if that works. On second thought, I'm not going to do that because that don't make sense because um, I won't be able to use these and the mic because I'm wired <laughs> so that that wouldn't make any sense I would I would just plug my I, I'll plug it in the splitter and then plug my mic into the mic port and the headphone in the head port head port of the camera so what I am going to try to do though I am going to try I'm going to put my mic into here and then I'm going to try to plug 
and and use that mic instead of uh, the lavalier mic and let's see how that works hang tight check one two okay so this mic works fine with it um, of course the headphones whoops of course the headphones are not going to you know what I'm saying I'm not going to be because the headphones I would have to plug in I got my splitter on here I would have to plug the headphones into there I'm wired doesn't make sense but in a pinch I could still use this mic and if it sounds really good I can you know I could actually use this um, during doing other things like if I'm behind the camera and whatnot I could still use this mic because I think this mic sounds pretty good so that'll also be a comparison between this mic and the lavalier mic so right now I'm using this mic I'm going to unplug it and plug the lavalier mic in let's see what the difference is now the lavalier mic is plugged in as you can see I'll take this clear off here so the lavalier mic is plugged in so that kind of gives us an idea of what that mic sounds like and this mic sounds like so pretty cool so let me go in let me get this taken care of see how good it picked up and everything I'll meet you in the garage okay guys as you might be able to see if I do this and you can probably tell I am using the wireless mic on the last clip here because I like the sound of it I I think the headphone mic sounds better uh, I think it sounds better than probably any mic I've got other than the um, the the boom mic I've got for um, the computer it sounds really good but I think it's as far as these mics I think it's the best sound of mic but this mic does sound really really good let me know what you think in the comments below but I think it sounds awesome for you know $71 you know 65 is what I gave for them it was six dollars delivery uh, so or shipping whatever you want to call it so yeah, I'm really satisfied with them. Um, I'll just I'll have to let you know the uh, the longevity of these of this uh, wireless mic system here. You know, as time goes by, um, I'm sure you'll see me using this mic quite a bit. And uh, and if you noticed when I walked around the shed, it didn't cut out once, and that's a metal shed, so you know I'm, I'm pretty happy about that it's not that I'm ever going to be behind something like that but you never know if I doing something in here got to run outside for something grab a tool <coughs> or whatever I know it's going to pick it up so I mean I don't know how I'm going to show you this but I'll tell you what let's do I'm going to go outside right now and talk to you guys okay and I'm going to wave at the camera so what I'll do I'm going to wave at the uh, at the cameras up here. All right. Now what I'm going to do is I'll go outside. I'm going to put you on what is this camera for? I'm going to put you on camera four so you guys can see it maybe a little bit better. Okay. Um, let me get my glasses on and see what you guys are seeing. See so if you guys can see that not real well let me zoom you in oh by the way i keep thinking when i got something on top of this this camera here um the zoom button is right underneath it and i thought man that kind of sucks but then i'm looking on my touch screen and i can actually use my touch screen for that so that's pretty good so i'm going to go outside and i'm going to talk to you guys excuse me and I'll wave at you and stuff and we'll see if that picks up good you might hear my phone going off because of the ring doorbell so here I am I'm out here guys in fact you guys are in the garage I don't oh I don't know if you can hear that because my phone's inside and I got the mic out here but I'm gonna go over here by the truck let's see if it picks up now you guys are in a garage that is a block home it's all block except for the ceiling of course so all right hopefully this picked up 
If not, I'll put it across the screen. <laughs> okay. I don't know if you heard that just as we came in, but my phone was going off. So, all right, guys. So there you go. There's that. Oops, sorry again. Okay. So now let's back you back out wide angle. I've only got four minutes on my card, but that's okay. I'm getting ready to... Uh, go ahead and close this video out here. I'm going to end it here. And I'm going to say thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Hopefully, if some of you guys are uh, wanting to get a set of wireless mics, hopefully this helps you. Like I said, I can't, I don't know, you know, the longevity. I do know it's got good reviews. Of course, uh, there was a couple, you know, where they had some issues with them. I don't know. Uh... Like one was it didn't come in on time or something like that. And I think they were a day late or something. Kind of nitpicking stuff. And uh, another one was uh, they only gave it two stars because they they said it, sh it should have rechargeables. I can understand that. I'd like them having rechargeables too. But I've always got extra batteries with me. So to me, that's not an issue right now, you know, uh, from, from what I can tell, uh, just being able to go around a steel shed from about 75 feet, um, and then going outside here, hopefully that picked that up. If not, I'll have to put it across the screen, but and going outside. So right now, you know, I'm going to give it a uh, four and a half stars. And if it lasts longer than a year, I'll give it a five star. Because um, these things get beat around a lot. You know, you're outside, you're inside, you're in the heat, you're in the cold. So I'll have to let you know as time goes on how well they're doing. But right now, I'm very happy with them. Four and a half stars right now. If it gets me through a year, I'm going to give it a five star. But right now, my rating is four and a half stars. And I appreciate you guys watching. Hopefully, this helps somebody. And, uh... That's all I got to say about that. So, and I like the case. <coughs> Excuse me. The price is reasonable because some some of these mics, you know, you can you can spend seventeen hundred dollars on a on a mic system, but you get all kinds of them. Three or four transmitters, you know, for different people. Um, but if I want to use different people, I'll just use a splitter and run two mics. It, it's not that big of a deal to me because usually it's just going to be one person just me using it or maybe monkey which by the way fun fact real quick story um she when i told her order and she said you only ordered one i'm like yeah why she goes well i thought maybe you'd order me one i said oh honey i'm so sorry but your camera does not have a mic input so an external mic input so anyway <laughs> i told her when i make it big and become famous i'll get her a nice camera <laughs> and a nice mic so anyway monk hang in there for <laughs> we'll get you taken care of shea bear the myth the man the legend i'm gone for now thanks for watching guys appreciate it enjoy the rest of your week not long the weekend will be here we'll see you soon and take care bye bye